stranger to running for a seat in the North Carolina legislature. I've been on the ballot more than anybody in Davidson County, so <laughs> my name is there permanently. I reckon it's etched in stone now. Eddie Gallimore is making his seventh bid for the North Carolina legislature. His only win came in 2018 when he won a Senate seat, defeating his current opponent, Sam Watford. Why do you keep doing this? I feel that the citizens, not only of Davidson County, but of our state and our country, deserve people that are willing to put yourself out there uh, and to uh, go the distance and to go against the grain, so to speak. One change Gallimore says he wants to make involves North Carolina's car inspections law. It's a money racket, <laughs> plain and simple. Politicians aren't going to address it because they don't care. They're driving around in new high dollar cars, Teslas and Mercedes and what have you. So you're getting the check engine light and you can't pass inspection. Right. I have to go through a act of Congress. Uh, Tennessee don't do this. Uh, other states don't do it. Why are we doing it? I asked the candidate where he stands on issues such as casinos and medical marijuana. When you are in pain or suffering, anything that can help you should be able to be gotten for your health purposes. Do I think we should have casinos? Yeah. No, I do not. And why not? I'm, a, I'm not a gambler. Uh, Could be revenue. Yeah, but it's not all about the money. Do you want to eliminate the personal income tax in North Carolina? Uh, yeah, I would like to see a, a sales tax. You would trade the income for a sales tax? Yeah, I would. Why is that a better deal? Uh, everybody pays a sales tax. Gallimore questions whether leaders in Raleigh know what's going on back home. The people that's in power are not in touch with the common, everyday, ditch-digging, uh, reporter, cameraman, uh, plumber, hairdresser, this out here living day to day to day. You know, everybody wants $15 an hour. That's great. But what comes along with $15 an hour? $5 a loaf of bread. Uh, so we're no better off. Gallimore's opponent in next month's primary is Sam Watford, who currently holds this seat. Bill O'Neill, WXII 12 News.